on the map of China. From the Qinghai Tibet Plateau, from west to east, the terrain is from high to low, formed three steps with a clear pattern. Inner Mongolia Plateau, the second order of the subject, between the eastern plains B and the third staircase, most important dividing line. It is thousands of miles. The Taihong Mountains with deep ravines. Along the eastern foot of the Taihong Mountains, an ancient avenue from south to north. It is also the thousands of years of Chinese civilization, long road of evolution. From Chinese ancestors, area of the earliest urban settlements, central plains all the way to the north, finally connect the northeast plain and Koshao Road on the Mongolian Plateau and distributed in the Taihong Mountains, several north-south valley corridors formed the regional Chinese road system. While the thickest occupied and the first to occupy the location of this road network hub, Yicheng was established in the small plain of Beijing. For the next 3,000 years, minorities growing stronger in the north through these important valley passages and the Han Dynasty in the Central Plains, uninterrupted battle and fusion. West Hill Avenue, spread rise and fall, gradually form a relatively complete network. This huge road network also became Beijing, the ancient capital of Witnesses the Six of Dynasties growth. and evolution. When the city has not faded green, the golden autumn of Shushan has come. Autumn in Daxishan, brilliant and colourful. This is the time of year on the top of Baihua Mountain. The busiest season. The flow of people and the flow of cars. In the beautiful autumn scenery of Shushan, of course, including this paragraph, known as the most beautiful Panchen Highway in Beijing. Bai Wu Mountain is 1998 meters above sea level. Xiongwang Temple was built in the Tang Dynasty. It is the highest Buddhist temple in Beijing. Every day when the sun rises, the only resident monk here is Fasheng Monk. We'll ring the morning blunt on time. The rising sun in the sky shines on the rolling valley. To the east of the valley is the city of Beijing. In the past seven or eight years, a Xiongwang temple in Woda. Only monk fashion abbots alone. Cold weather, bad weather is an important reason. After entering October, the top of Baihua Mountain will usher in a long period of ice and the Snow. temperature will continue to be minus 20 to 40 degrees Celsius. Since ancient times, Shishon is not only for the small plain of Beijing, the last gateway to shield the cold outside the Great Wall. It is a magical treasure house of energy. In the bitter cold winter in the north, here is Beijing City, bringing warmth that lasts for thousands of years.
to the importance of Shishan to Beijing. It's because of the Yujin hidden here. According to the records of the Tin Dynasty annals, analysis of economics Jinzi. outside the city, buy cattle and load them into carts every September, load coal to Shishan Kiln Head. Hundreds of coal are sent every day. From the Liao Dynasty, large scale mining has begun here. It developed to its peak in the Qing Dynasty. Emperor Kangxi once said, cooking cuisine for millions of soldiers and civilians Jung in Beijing. Shishan coal. That's all. The first batch of regular visitors on the Shishan ancient road. Horseman who transports coal. And their team of mules. On the steep and winding mountain road. Long distance walking. Mule stamina. Far better than a healthy horse. Over a thousand years. They are the ancient Shishon Road absolute protagonist. Because every mule, they all follow in the footsteps of the previous one. Day to day, shoehorns on coals, under the double weight of, due to numerous overlapping stampedes. Those mountain roads paved with whole rocks, left one by one. Feet several centimetres deep. Faster. These footprints are all over the, on every hub of Shishon Road. Inscribed with the Shishon Coal Transportation the rise Road and Network. Fall since the Yuan Dynasty. With the adjoining trail. Deep hooves. Hard stone. Trampled by years of mules and horses. It has become a stamp branded on the mountain path. Thousands of years. On the Shishan Bustling ancient road, the Shishan, Shishan ancient came road. and went. Not only mules, horses, coal carts and merchants, there are also sturdy cavalry from the Plateau tribe. They've been fighting. Control over the fertile water plain. Therefore Shishan Road, in addition to carrying the transport function, also became a natural administrative boundary ridge. Dohanling was called Dohanling in ancient times, said to have been the Huns, one of the boundary mountains written about the Han dynasty, since the Yuan dynasty, inspectorate, became the boundary of the division under Wanping County, still is. Jotong Town, Mentugu District, the dividing line with Dotoli Town. The Great Cold Ridge is not only the history of the past Administrative dynasties. boundaries. At the same time, it has also become a cultural boundary. Folk life in the East and West. Language diets vary widely. The flower hat is a family heirloom of Seidogawa. Delicacy made with floral hats. It is the representative delicacy of Jaitong Shuan. There is a little black cow in our family, shy belly oiled. This riddle is called the flower hat. 68 year old Tantian Hu. Her home is on the side of National Highway 109. It is only 18 kilometers away from Bai Hua Mountain in the west. As an authentic Jotong person, she is right Tan Wong. There is a lot of research on the unique local eating method. This way of eating is different from this great cold ridge to the other side. It is eaten this way. Roll up this wanger and serve it with vegetables. Roll up and eat. Great cold ridge towards us to Zhongjiu Ko. It's rice, it's food, it's food. Ten years with good cooking skills. She put the small restaurant run by herself, 
Jaitong Shuan. Even Mentugu District, special restaurants that everyone knows. I opened a restaurant in 1989. On the side of this road, there were very few tourists at that time. Mainly from Shaanxi Natong Lokol. More dog cars. National Highway 109 is also called Jin Road. Connect Shanshai until Lhasa. Former mule and horse caravan porter. Has long been lost in the long river of history. But the genes of the thousand-year-old row still in the collection, in people's lives today. Jaitong Shuan. Fate cake is a traditional wedding banquet, an essential meal by both male and female families. Co-produced. Man out of flour. Wife's home production. A large amount of salt is thick and salty. A symbol of salt fate far reaching. And this salty custom. Jinxi ancient road. Are closely related. Relying on mules and horses for long distance Zero transportation. Short distance travel. More salt is not easy to spoil. Portable food Portable island. food. Bound to become mainstream. In the middle of Shishon Avenue, there is a well-known village called Jiayuan. Leek Gardens fame. Pickles from here. Chive garden pickles made with ancient methods. Not only the choice of vegetables is strict, it is also very particular about the season of pickling. Up to now, the whole process is still insisted on by hand. Fresh, crispy and mellow. This taste has changed for a hundred years. It's not about how much we have to eat. It's not right to eat half a bag. This taste has never changed through the centuries. Connecting the city and the mountain village. It also connects today and the past. Shifuling ancient road in Wangping town, Mentegu. Dense hooves pass through here. Standing on a steep cliff. Looking down at a distance of less than 100 meters. The old course of Yongding River flowing for thousands of years. Ancient commercial roads spanning thousands of years. The 100 year old Jingmen branch line. Of the as Beijing Jongjiu Railway. Today. National Highway 109 runs side by side. Jinxi ancient road, not centered on one path, but a large and small. Hundreds of threads intertwined in mountain road in the hinterland of Daxi Mountain. Joint road system. They hook up the majestic Taihong Mountains. Separated to feet. Nomads, fishermen and farmers. Through here, towards integration and prosperity. Old locust tree at the entrance of Nanjiao village. It is said to be over a thousand years old. It is on this road. Most qualified spectators. Ming and Qing dynasties to the Republic of the China. The prosperity of Nanjiao business once surpassed Fangshan County. This is an important branch of the Jinxi ancient road. Northwest can be connected to Mongolia. In addition to coal transportation, here is still from Shaanxi. Ida Mongolia leather products, trading markets with mainland grocery department stores. The curliest and largest department store in the south of Beijing, salt cloth and leather goods medicine shop. Food store jewelry store blacksmith shop. More than 20 large scale firms. Focus on this. 
on a commercial street less than 4,000 metres long. Outlines of Lingshan streets and alleys, still clear and complete. The hustle and bustle of the year, nature is gone. Located in Old Street, entrance to Cross Street building from west to east, that is called Nine Young Temple of Rini Bureau. Caravans in the earliest, distributing and trading in Nanjiao. Before entering the village, you must worship to the gods of the four directions in order to protect the, tide. the dry river bed. It is far away from Guojilo and Nine Young Temple. It used to be a large scale theatre building. Now there are only scattered frames, dilapidated murals. But in the past hundreds of years, it is the scenery of this dry pier. Status symbol. Smooth traffic not only brought prosperity to business, bring more prosperity to culture, strictness of mind. Daxi Mountain connected by peaks and ridges, walking with the shadows. There seems to be a set of self-contained philosophical system. From ancient times and from afar, mortals and immortals seem to be able to hear, live at ease. Nearly a hundred years ago, a name, The Americans by Sidney David Gamble, record with his camera. The Mao Feng Shang Xiong Festival was unprecedentedly grand at that time. These unusually vivid records in the eyes of today's viewers. I feel the real shock. In the Shishan Ancient Road, there is a very special kind of and fork the extremely important road. Shandao refers to people, pilgrimage path. Maofeng Mountain Incense Road, Myandan covers as far as Jiangjin, Hebei, near the foot of the West Mountain, Mentugu Fangshan Haidian Shijingshan. During the heyday of Qing Dynasty, every year from that day to the fifth day of April, believers on this incense walk up to 100,000 people per day in the hearts of devout pilgrims be able to do good deeds with one's own asceticism complete a pilgrimage the happiness in my heart is incomparable one of the most common ways is to do what you can to help others such a volunteer organized in the form of a meeting to shed old club steamed bun old club Lighting old club. Responsibilities are clear and rules are strict, passed down from generation to generation for hundreds of years. People in this organization believe such kindness, not only to please the gods, it can also be brought to officials, long lasting peace. The road is for the people of Daxishan. Life brings along and vigorous vitality. It also broadens their horizons. Bright heart. They know how to respect. Respect everything. Be at peace with all. They accept the constant and are open to change. On the gate of Fu Kengmen in Old Beijing. The plum blossom carved in stone represents the coal gate. Mark the gate. It's a coal truck. This gate is also the West Mountain Road, Beijing's destination. Depart from Fu Kengmen Bridge today. Drive 20 kilometers along Fushi Road. You can reach three stores in Mentugu District. 
Here is the history of Daxishan for thousands of years. Wood coal stone. Along the Yongding River Canyon, the first station for distribution. After being transported out of it the mountains, it is also a road network bridge at the foot of Shishan Mountain River Hub. Known as Beijing Road Conditions, one of the most complex and dense coordinates. From ancient times, the first railway bridge to Beijing. From the ancient road network to the modern industrial transport artery. When the wheel of history turns, the last moments of the 19th century, Shishan Avenue ushered in. Own modern time. Early 10th century, on the mountain path of Yongding River Canyon, here comes a determined engineer. He repeatedly surveyed all scriptures to prove. OK from here, cross the Yongding River Gorge to reach Shisheng. It will be an extinct railway line. This engineer is Zon Tianyu. He was ordered by the Qing government to find a link to Beijing. Railway location with beyond the Great Wall. However, after budget planning, after comparing with engineering difficulty, due to the complex construction of this line, it cost a lot of money and was given up by Zon Tianyu. Finally, he looked. Cast to the northeast. A road at the northernmost end of Daxi Mountain. Famous ravine. Taihong Mountain in China. Right about the fault zone of Yanshan, the first classic known as the Eight Classics in ancient times. Jun Duxing. Doctrine that shocked the West. Modern railway. In Nailu Jingjong Railway Bureau, Zan Tianyu, chief engineer. Officially started. For years later, this line was issued by the Chinese. Independent Design Investment Construction, Stay Tone Trunk Railway. Perfect appearance in front of the world. Zon Tianyu is exquisite and Herring intelligent. Bone track design. Solved the train. Difficulty going up a 33 degree slope. Make China backward and weak a hundred years ago. In world railway history. Took a place. This also pulls. The great curtain of China's modern road transport history. Zon Tianyu devoted all his life to the Beijing Embedded Railway. A life-size bronze statue of Zon Gong Tianyu in 1922. In his stood by the world. The love of his life. Next to Qingqia Herringbone Track. Witness the history of China's railways in the past century. In 1952, Nearly half a century later, Zon Tianyu reluctantly gave up that year. Beijing Zhongjiakou Railway first plan, re-entering the new China railway construction. In blueprint. Fengxia line starts from Beijing Fengtai Railway Station. In the north south. to Shishen County, Hebei. The whole journey is 106 kilometers. High mountains and deep valleys meandering along the Yongding River. A total of 130 to two-way tunnels. Many winding bridges. After it was put into use in 1955, because of its strong transport capacity, become the main channel for Shanxi coal transportation also became New China, one of the busiest railways. However, little is known about. Because the western mountains are 100 difficult and dangerous. railway construction paid for. It is the life of more than a hundred railway construction workers. One ma down a warrior. Such a sacrifice builds. History of railway construction in the Republic. Unfallen monument. This is the railway line of the Beijing Shibai High Speed Railway. 
This is also Mr. Hurenzi, written in 1942, according to Peking Historical Geography. 5,000 years at the southern foot of Taihong Mountain, the old way of the ancient road. Marco Polo Bridge, standing at the standing largest at the crossing largest of the ferry of the Han River. Here is Marco Polo from the west. The place where you first landed on the other side of the Great Eastern the Yongin River has been flowing for thousands of years. What is surging at this moment belongs to today. The pulse of the moment. The road visibly wins. It's a blood vessel, it's a meridian. The invisible vast ups and downs of the road. It's the soul, it's the spirit. There is a road in the mountains, circling no matter how. It is always possible to climb the peak. There are roads in the city, weather ups and downs. One day, wander home. Road of times. There is a big dream of national rejuvenation. There is a picture scroll of the two belts and one road. Inclusiveness and mutual learning on this road. Hand in hand. There is a way between the past and the present. Connecting the north and the south. The footprints stretch, those who go, go, those who go still. Shishan Yuda can see prosperity, can afford the wish. There is an endless road in Shishan, endless forever. 